Hi, it's uh, Simon here from Tutor Online. Um, I've been asked by a number of you um, to demonstrate how to create a page using Artisteer. So I thought I'd, I, what I would do is I'd put together a very straightforward, short little demonstration just to show you how easy it is. So in front of us here, we've got our, or I've got my website I've done for my local Indian restaurant, which I tend to visit far too often. And what I want to do is um, I'm going to pretend they've asked me to add another page. So I'm going to demonstrate this for you. So what I can do is I can simply go over to the um, left hand column here and I can either right click on this um, option here and select new page. Or if I've got my home tab um, selected on the top here, you'll notice in the, the bar along the top here, we've got also a new page option. So if I select the new page option, you'll see there's a little pop up window appears and it gives me a number of options. So um, what I can do is I can create um, a page with just um, a big area to put my information in or I can put columns like a, like a, a magazine or a, a newspaper or I can set up um, one column with three little columns below however really I want to set up my, my page. So I'm going to select the one in the middle here highlighted because I've got my special deals along the bottom here and I want to be able to put some extra information so I click on that option. You'll see on the left hand side um, it brings up a new page and gives me the option to put a, a name in there. So let's put in here menu details, just for example. I'm not obviously just doing this for demonstration purposes. And then you'll see my page is displayed in um, in front of me here. So if I put the mouse over the page, you can see here I've got my layout that I've selected from that pop-up window. So what I can do then is I can put my content in here about the menu. I can then go down to the other columns here and what I could do is I could then cut and paste my images from my special deals if you remember but I'm just doing this purely for demonstration purposes so I've got content there if I go to the next one here then there and then I can put in content there as well so you can see here then really I've got my th my free screen set up so what I can then do is I can then start to select the little drop down boxes in each of the columns and say, okay, how do I want to change the information or how do I want to change the lookout? So I can then start um, selecting the fill. I can add extra rows as well. So uh, if I decide that actually I haven't um, set up the page in the way that I want to, I can then insert a row, a, row, a row before or a row after. Okay, and so I can basically set up my page. Once I put all the content in then, it's saved. And then what I can do is I can upload it to my site. So, um, what I might do is another tutorial show you how you actually upload the information to WordPress because um, there's an option in here where you can actually you've created your website here with all the content and then you go into WordPress and you upload it. Um, I hope this little quick demonstration has been useful to you. Um, please subscribe to my channel if you want to see some more free tutorials coming up. Um, and also um, I'm putting together a website where um, you'll be able to um, log in and download some cheat sheets and stuff like that so I'm going to be doing some more tutorials in the future.